So I've had lots of lovely messages about my tips on ironing fitted sheets. So I thought I would share with you how I wash the sheets and hang them out. Um, I'm quite particular about how I do it, um, but it saves hours. So I'm gonna share this little secret with you. So first of all, we shall strip the beds and then I shall show you what I do. Right, so here goes, I've got my pillows and I shall take the pillowcases off. Now I fold them. I know it sounds ridiculous, folding, dirty washing, but I do. And it, trust me, saves a lot of creases. So they get folded and into the laundry basket. And I should take that one off as well. There we are. Pretty neatly folded. And then the duvet. And this one's got poppers, just pull that. Ooh, can I pull it? Yeah. And again, I fold this. It really, really does work, trust me. I also um, note whether the sheets are particularly dirty or if they've got a mark, and if they have, I either use vanish spray before they go in the washing machine, or I just put a scoop of vanish in with the wash. I will show you that in a minute. So I'll just get a good shake corners together. I know it does seem totally ridiculous folding, dirty washing. There we are. And then put the fitted sheet. And they do still wash perfectly well, trust me. I don't do it inside out though, I fold them the right way round. And again, with the fitted sheet, I do the corners and those corners. And then I fold it like I would, not as perfectly when I've ironed it, but as well as can be you know, done. Like that. And in to the laundry basket and that's how they go into the machine. So I'm here in my laundry room and I've got a scoop of Fairy Non-Bio which I'm going to pop into there and then I'm going to put one capful of Comfort into the middle in there. I use Fairy and Comfort when I wash whites and all of our bed linen for the B&Bs um, is all white and it just makes it much easier and then I can mix and match and I know that that's all B&Bs. Um, then if the sheets are dirty um, or any stains or anything, I use a scoop of this. Actually, these sheets aren't, aren't bad at all. There's no nasty marks. So I have folded them beautifully, as you saw, and now I'm going to pop them into the machine. Like that. I'm going to close that, close the door, and then I'm going to pop them onto cottons. I'm going to pop them on at 60 degrees, and then I'm going to do speed perfect, and that cuts the time down, saves on energy, and it doesn't need, without speed perfect, it's two hours 45 minutes, it does not need that long. So that's an hour and six minutes, which is perfect. And then off we go, and then I'll show you how I hang them out when it's finished. So the washing machine is just finished. I've got a laundry basket at the ready and I shall pull it into there. Give the drum a spin just to check that there's nothing caught. Invariably there is, but not today. And now I shall hang it out. So I've got a Sheila's made and I'm a massive fan. They work on a pulley system. We don't have 
high ceilings here, so I don't actually tend to move that very often. But they're brilliant. Send the washing up and get it out of the way, and you can use them in um, all sorts of places. I've actually got one above the auger, which is brilliant for drying. But we're going to hang this out in here today. So I'm going to give this pillowcase a really good shake and pull, and then hang it out there. And you can see it's already pretty um, uncreased. Um, show you a fitted sheet now. So again, this has come slightly unfolded in the washing machine, but I'm going to put my corners into my corners. If you're watching me, you'll know the score now. Um, corner into corner, and then that one too. And then I'm going to just put it over the rail there. Um, and like that. And just make sure it's nice and straight and then it will dry like that and it makes it so much easier when it comes to ironing and actually you might not even need to bother ironing it either. So now a duvet cover. So this is still actually pretty well folded so I should just pop that over there. And Again, as I'm going, I'm just pulling it because it's not so easy to give this a good shake like it is with a pillowcase. But just make sure it's nice and folded and straight on the rail. So there, I shall crack on and hang the rest of the washing out now. So there we are, we've got two sets of bed sheets hung out on the Sheila's Maid. Because I folded them first and I've hung them out carefully, they should need a lot less ironing if you even need to bother. Um, this Sheila's Maid has got six um, wooden slats, um, but you can have them made to, to order, which is brilliant, so it can fit your space. I do hope you've enjoyed today's video and you found my tips useful. Please do like and subscribe.